Hi, it's Uncle Laurie here with a Sunday shave, with a Sunday sample shave today. And today's sample is from Razor Rock. Of, uh, <laughs> print out a little sheet here. It's the Dead Sea. Uh, so, which comes in a um, a jar, you know, a 250 mil jar normally when you buy it. I've got a little sample here in a little sample jar, courtesy of Peter. Peter from uh, KWSE. And I've already got it all loaded up here in my bowl. A nice, nice leather there. So I'll wet the face, as they say. The word, giving it a bit of a towel down, wet towel. One, and I'll use my little piece of soap from Artisan Dan. Shaving soap. <laughs> that I don't get very good leather performance from. It's uh, it's an olive oil based soap. Normally I prefer to have a a glycerin based soap as a pre-shave. Olive oil or coconut oil is a good alternative. As you can see, gives me a nice layer to start with. Now my hands are slippery, I'll put a bit of alum on my fingers. Today comes from Billy Goat. It's called Billy Goat Valencia. It's got a 26 mil mother load knot in it, which is very soft, luxuriously soft actually. Feels like a, um, a makeup brush. See how soft it is. That's about my wife's makeup brush. Looks almost the same. It's a lot smaller, of course. The scent from the shop. So it's a light medium. It's a lovely scent, it's a mix of lemon, rosemary, cannabis, saffron and sandalwood. The strength, like I said, is about, yeah, about, um, yeah. about uh, oh, the razor I'm using is the leaf. All three blades are in there. The blades I'm using, in position one I've got a Lord stainless steel saloon blade, already, these are already pre-cut, and then the other two spots I've got a Permasharp. I put the Permasharp up higher in the less aggressive positions because uh, they're a sharper blade and a little bit rougher. So I'm give that a wet and see here we go I've used this razor for a while so 
and the handle can get slippery so I'll took it out on, on my fingers. So I'll just go with the grain. Because of the big head, you can't get up underneath that nose in a normal way, so you have to go across like that. So that soap is mm, pretty slippery. Great performance. So far, we are rinse off a little bit. Yeah, that's so. Lovely. Paint a bit more on. This soap scent reminds me a bit of um, my parents' house down on the beach. <laughs> my brother in his day used to grow cannabis in the backyard behind the shed. So I get a bit of that. The you other know, comparison I can make is uh, I get a little bit of um, so what do you call soap for um, imperial leather? It's a slight imperial leather scent from it. Probably the uh, sandalwood and saffron scents coming through. It's called Dead Sea uh, soap because the, uh, they actually use Dead Sea salt in the recipe. Oh yes, that's nice and slick. Plenty of residual there. You don't want to press too hard, uh, it's like any other tea eraser. You just need to press it just enough to engage the, uh, the head on the skin. You don't want to press down like you would a car. Or well, I don't know, maybe you don't press down on a car. Long time since I've used one. There you can see I've got plenty of slickness and protection there left over there. I think that wins. Yes, I really like the scent. I don't have a full jar. It's on my wish list. <laughs> the must get with wish list. Oh, hang on, I got a bit of soap up my nose. I think it's good. 
Don't want to do a big sneeze all over the camera. Probably covered it with uh, leather. Very luxurious painting with this brush. I wouldn't uh, think a, a super soft knot is for everyone. I enjoy it. Right, I'll do it again, screen pass. Residual there, you can see. Now this upper portion of the lip, I'll have to use another razor. I can't, uh, well, it's very difficult to use this right underneath there. I normally just use another razor to finish that off. So far, so good. Gives me a lovely shave. I think this is going to be a BBS, I think.
Wow, that's close. That's very nice. Very slick soap. A lot of residual there. Slick and protective. Another good soap from Razor Rock. It appears anything in the glass jars is a top performer. may even be slicker than the, um, the triple X fresco. Not much out there. I'm calling that a nice shave. Lovely shave. Probably uh, pretty close to BBS, I'll call it. Just the one weeper, which has already stopped. Oh, that's it. I'll rinse off. Bit of alum around. See how we Just a couple of tingles around the lip area. A few tingles, but nothing um, really bad. So that normally indicates a pretty good close shave. Any weepers showing up at this stage? Oh, I'll call it a shave. So um, I'll just pause there for a minute and um, I'll come back after my shower to do my post shave. We'll see you shortly. Hi, back from my shower. How's everybody going? Hope you didn't. Uh, Go away. Right. I'll just go. No, we won't. I'll put on my post shave. I'll start with the um, the Thayer's witch hazel. I've just got lavender and mint in it. It's a very smooth shave. That was a lovely shave, look at that. I'm going to call it a 10 out of 10 shave. Another 10 out of 10. Bit of Lucky Tiger finishing cream. Change the order of my post and dips instead of doing the aftershave after my witch hazel, I'm doing it after. The bar. This is a recommendation I picked up from uh, Con from uh, the Stray Whisker last week. He's uh, he had a lot of in a live video went over five things you could do to improve your shave, and that was one of them, or part of one of them. Can't remember exactly. All right, while they're settling now. And absorbing, I'll go over what uh, I used in the shave. The brush was a Billy Goat, that's his coin. It 
with the ultra soft mother load knot as you can see it's quite a soft knot doesn't have any backbone as such the raise I used is the leaf leaf with the pivoting head I've got uh, it's got three blade positions I've got all three filled they go down the bottom is the most aggressive position and second aggressive and then ultra mild position is up the top I did a few touch ups with um, the twig also made by leaf and the soap I used was a sample from Razor Rock uh, the Dead Sea that's the, <laughs> that's the label and it's a great performing soap lovely shave I had it's um, settled enough I'll, uh, I'll splash on my blue stratus That's quite a nice match to the soap. Lovely. All right. Uh, I think that's all the gear. Oh yeah, I used the bowl. I used was the yucky yucky bowl. Anything else I used? No, that's it. Oh, the blades. I used the Lord Blade in the uh, first position and in the uh, twig and the Puma Sharp in the the Molder positions of the, the Leaf Razor and that's it I hope everyone's having a lovely weekend and uh, we'll catch you on my next shave which will be probably Wednesday thank you very much for watching and we'll see you again